So in a show about extreme cooking, let's do the extreme with bacon. Now listen, I can't stress enough. Do not do this at home. Here's what you're gonna need. You're gonna need a curling iron, but not just any curling iron. You wanna make sure it's a barrel type, wider the better, and make sure it's got a clip. If it doesn't have a clip, well, you just can't cook bacon on a curling iron, and then what's the point of having a curling iron? Seriously, did you not check this at the store? I also want you to get a piece of thick cut bacon. Yum. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna start to wrap this around your curling iron. So, what I want you not to do again is one, try this at home, all right? And two, make sure that you don't have this plugged in first. You wanna make sure that this is cold first, or this is gonna be very difficult. So let's pop that right there. Isn't that nice, isn't that beautiful? Let's make sure we're touching the curling iron all the way down and my bacon is clipped. And we're gonna set that right there. And the last step, <laughs> plug it in. And now we wait. All right, so our bacon looks like it's done. That's just the craziest thing ever. So yes, unplug it first, and then let's have a peek here. We're gonna undo that and see if we can get this off in like a nice, perfect little ring there. Now, it seems to me that Conair didn't design this specifically for cooking bacon because, it, of course, it's not super even all the way along the barrel. You got hot spots and stuff, but uh, you know, if the question that we were looking to answer is, can I cook bacon with a curling iron, I gotta say, the answer seems to be yes. Now, do you want to? I don't know. Mmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. Salami.